we're going to do the muscles of the of the thigh. Here we have the uh, the um, anterior thigh, and here's the anterior superior iliac spine as an orientation point of the coxa. Here we have the uh, tensor fasci lati or lati muscle here, and you can see that it's attached to this uh, this fascia, this tendon called the iliotibial tract, sometimes also called the iliotibial band. So you can see that iliotibial tract that we're just going to reflect back so that we can see the underlying musculature of the thigh. So we have our uh, quadriceps, which are four. So we're going to look at those four muscles and we're going to uh, look at them from lateral to medial. And so the first one is called the vastus lateralis. So here you can see the vastus lateralis muscle, one of our quadriceps running right up the midline anchoring to that uh, anterior superior iliac spine is this muscle here this is the rectus femoris muscle one of our quadriceps if we ref if we fold that back you can see this muscle immediately posterior to it deep to it and this is called the um, the rectus or uh, the vastus intermedius so you can see the vastus intermedius. You'll notice that it's still covered in its fascia, and we see that also in the models as well. So here you have the vastus intermedius. And then the fourth of our quadriceps, quad meaning four, is this muscle here, which is the vastus medialis. So when it's on the medial side of the thigh. So we have four quadriceps. Here's our vastus lateralis, the rectus femoris, the vastus intermedius, and the vastus medialis. So those four muscles make up our quadriceps. We have another major muscle running through the thigh that crosses from the anterior superior iliac spine to the medial side of the knee. And this is the sartorius muscle. There's our sartorius muscle. And then if we look at our medial, our medial thigh, we see several muscles here. This is a muscle called the iliopsoas muscle. And you can see that it actually goes under this ligament here and actually goes through the lower half of the, of the body and attaches to the coccyx. So this is the iliopsoas muscle. And then working my way lateral to medial from my iliopsoas muscle, you have your pectineus. So here's the pectineus muscle. Here you have your adductor longus one of our adductor groups of the thigh. So here's the adductor longus. And then if we go deep to that, you have your adductor brevis. So the adductor longus muscle and the adductor brevis muscle. And then the last muscle that we can see from the front is this muscle here, and this is called the gracilis muscle, the gracilis muscle. So doing those, once again, I like to start from the sartorius just to orient myself. Here you have your iliopsoas muscle your pectineus muscle, your adductor longus, your adductor brevis, and the gracilis.